stranger nearly raped a 14-year-old girl along a busy road. A friend saved her. Tonight, North College Hill police say the suspect is giving a bizarre motive for the attack. Reporter Jay Warren is live in North College Hill with a story you'll see only on 9 on your side. Jay? Well, Car Clyde and Carol, it was here yesterday afternoon in North College Hill at Bud's Pony Keg when Charles Stevens allegedly spotted the two teenage kids, a 14-year-old girl, 16-year-old boy. Stevens left first and started walking west on Galbraith. The teens, a short distance behind him, they would ultimately catch up and pass Stevens. That's when police say he started following them and then ultimately grabbed the girl from behind and around her neck. Now, he allegedly grabbed her at the intersection of Galbraith and Kleindale. As they struggled, the 16-year-old boy leaped into action and fought off Stevens. Now, police say the teenager threw the 54-year-old man into a fence. And after the alleged attack, Stevens kept walking and told random people along the road that he was going to the police station to turn himself in for the alleged attempt. Now, police arrested Stevens a short while later right next to the police station. Broad daylight, right on Galbraith Road, and the, you know the. Uh, I guess the strange thing about it is after he did it, and the 16-year-old had notified us. Witnesses uh, stayed around and gave us a description and said that his intent was to actually rape the 14-year-old, and that he was on his way up to the police department. Now, North College Hill Police told us that Stevens may have some sort of mental disability. In fact, they told us that after his arrest, Stevens cited as a motive the fact that he was angry at his mother. This is a 54-year-old man angry at his mother for not allowing him to smoke, and he just snapped in his words. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, North College Hill. All right. Thanks, Jay. A